What is up, Omash Nation? How are you doing today? I hope you're doing so well, like always, and are ready and excited for today's video. This video right here, right now, is a special one because it is sponsored by Boksu, or Boksu, if you wanna say it all American-like. <laughs> this right here, guys, this box contains so many goodies. And that's what we're going to talk about today. Boksu is a premium Japanese monthly subscription snack box. And they fill this box up with all the best treats that you can find and imagine in Japan. And they bring it right to you, your door, every single month. Now what's cool about this Boksu box is that they work with all of these different snack makers all over Japan, partner with them so that they can come up with these themed snack boxes just for your liking and it sounds amazing. Guys, I am part Japanese. I love Japanese treats. I love anything Japanese. And so I'm so excited to see what is in this box and to continue the service and just enjoy a little piece of Japan every single month through Boksu. We are gonna crack into this box in today's video, check out all the treats inside, eat some treats. <laughs> so be excited for some Omash ASMR because that is going to happen and we're gonna crack some packs and I know we're gonna pull an alternate art because we have the Japanese Boksu snack box luck today. We're cracking open a Japanese EV Heroes booster box, hunting for an alternate art, guys. This is our fourth box and we have not pulled an alt art yet. So I know the Boksu box and the ASMR and the eating is gonna bring us some good luck, but you know the deal. Also hit that luck button right here <laughs> to bring the luck. Let's pull some alt arts. Let's check out what Boksu is and let's just have a blast doing it. So everyone in the comments, make sure to say big thank you to Boksu for sponsoring this video. All right, guys, everything is unpacked, ready. We have the Boksu box right here. We have our EV heroes. Let's open the Boksu box first and see what is inside. I am pumped. We're gonna have to zoom out for this bad boy. And of course, Omash Nation, if you want to subscribe to this box yourself and enjoy a little piece of Japan every single month, I mean, who wouldn't? They have the best snacks in the world. <laughs> then use my code OMASH20 right here, O-M-A-A-S-H-20. 20 to receive 20% off your first Japanese snack box from Boksu. Guys, it will be worth it, trust me. So I hope you guys take advantage and use that deal because this is gonna be awesome. So here we go. I have not opened this box yet, guys. So I am seeing everything for the first time myself. I'm opening it at the <laughs> wrong way. There it is, premium Japanese snacks. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's see what's inside here. Oh boy, discover Japan through snacks, I love it. Here we go, very nice snack. Thank you right there from Danny Taing, 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 <laughs> the founder of Boksu. We will have to read that later. And here we go guys, your very first box, whenever you subscribe, it is called the Seasons of Japan, and that is because it just spoils you with all the goodies from all over the place. Nice welcome to Boksu. And guys, like I mentioned, they partner with so many different snack creators all over Japan to create and make these theme snack boxes, so that is awesome. These are what we can expect in this box. Oh, it already looks good. I love mochi stuff, so we're gonna have to crack into that. So many snacks, I think there's like 20 snacks in every single box, and wow, there are a lot of goodies. That cookie looks delicious. Oh, look at that little dude, <laughs> and geez. I don't even think we'll be able to get through it all. And of course, guys, they throw in a very nice tea pairing that they pick that they think is will go nice and well with all the snacks that they picked. But here it is. Discover where your snacks are from. Like I said, look at all of those different places. We have Hokkaido, we have Nagano, we have Kyoto, Tokyo. They literally have creators and makers from all over Japan. And so they are able to create these awesome boxes just for you. I am super excited and let's just, uh, I'm gonna have to read through that later because I love anything Japanese. So wow, check it out guys. This box is full of goodies. We have, what's this one right here? Hokkaido red bean donuts. 
Red bean is not my favorite thing in the world, but I love donuts, so there is that. We have the yuzu sake candy. That is like a hard candy that uh, you can suck on. We'll, maybe we'll have to try that. Ooh, this one looks interesting. Don't know what this one is, but it is kind of soft and crunchy at the same time. We'll have to try that. Here are the, I don't think this is the tea pairings. No, 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 this is something else. No idea what it is. That looks like edamame though right there. Guys, there's so many. Here's the teas. We will not have time to go through that today, but I'm excited to try those. Oh, look at these little strawberry packages. <laughs> We're definitely gonna have that. And holy, oh yes, here's the mochis. Oh, I'm excited. I love mochi. Oh, they're squishy and they look like they're sweet. But look at that packaging. <laughs> so awesome. Oh gosh, there are seriously so many things. Pear fromage biscuit? What? Here we have a very interesting, that looks like uh, some sort of cake. I love cake. Oh uh, man, guys. I can't even say. Here's that, that cake. That looks a little scary. We'll probably have to try that just to uh, experiment, get a little risky here with homage. <laughs> that sounds weird. Uh, there's that cookie, looks delicious. Oh, some sort of fish crackers. Ugh, they love their fish stuff over there. Guys, like I said, there are so many things. Don't know what this is, but we'll find out. We're gonna try and open as many things as we can. And then we have two very last, oh man, what is that? What is that? Those are like little rice, maybe like chips. So that's what that feels like. What, but wow, we have so many things. I am so excited, that is everything in this box. Remember to use my code OMOSH20 at checkout to get 20% off your very first box and I hope all of you guys subscribe. So, I've been talking about this ASMR stuff, so I think for the first round, we're just gonna have to get a bunch of this stuff back on here. All right, everything's back, it's just a mess. But I love mochi, so I'm so curious. Let's zoom back into normal. I'm so curious to see what this tastes like. Little mochis, it looks like different flavors. And we're just gonna try this top one first. Oh boy, it looks like sugar-coated mochi right there. Let's see what we got. Mmm. Oh! That's so good. <laughs> I've never had sweet mochi before, but it was cool. The sugar on top made it all sweet and like kind of sugary, but then you actually got to the normal mochi taste. And for those who don't know, mochi is like a rice cake. It's like a very dense, thick <laughs> rice goo, and it's delicious, even though I made that sound disgusting. So I'm excited to eat the rest of those. Man, that was awesome. Mmm, and now, for our first packs. My fingers are gonna be kinda gross, so uh, we'll see how opening stuff <laughs> goes. And we will see if we can actually pull something with EV Heroes, because we have not had the best luck at all. Not starting well with first pack magic, but we have a lot of treats to try. <laughs> treats to try. And we have a bunch of packs to open, so maybe every, gosh, three, four packs or so, we will try a new treat. I just want to finish off the rest of that. Swamp Herd, very nice first holo. Uh, the mochi, that is delicious. I'm excited to share all of these with my mom. She is sh straight from Japan, as Japanese as they come. So I'm sure she has literally eaten every single thing in this box and I'm excited to share with her. I'm mostly excited though to share with my wife. <laughs> she has not had probably any of this stuff and man nothing better than uh, trying new things right that is what life is all about very nice right chew and let's see what is next I'm so curious about these they were like soft and fluffy but crunchy at the same time I don't know what these are but there we go look at that has it just been blurry this whole time too much to focus on I'll just kind of hold it far away but here we go what is that texture? Oh, I've had something like this before. Delicious, it's like a weird flowery coating. I ate this with mochi last time though, but guys, it's seriously the weirdest thing. This is solid right here, but the second you put it into your mouth, it just like explodes into some flowery, powdery mystery thing. Whoa! <laughs> That is delicious though. I told you, you're gonna get some good ASMR today. 
I love that. And woo, man. That was super cool. <laughs> I'm excited to eat the rest of those. And I can't wait to see the reaction of my wife's face when she tries that one. Really, that, yeah, it's so weird. I've never had anything like it. It just like, focus. It explodes in your mouth as soon as you bite down. Like super weird. <laughs> But um, yeah, seriously, Bulksu, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. I have been so blessed to be reached out a few times with the opportunities to be sponsored and uh, be gifted these crazy cool products for videos and it's seriously so fun. I would have never thought at all ever when I first started Pokemon, uh, this YouTube channel, that we would have gotten a sponsor. Oh, we got a nice, I don't know who this is. Is this Aroma Lady? <laughs> Very beautiful full art card right there. This lady has to go in a sleeve. So nice, very nice hit right there. I love full arts and that one is a goodie. Check her out, very nice pull. This is no alternate art or anything, but I'm hoping we can get another hit in this box. Let's try something else though. This is right here, this crazy packaging. This is air sealed. Let's see, it looks like Boksu. Oh, it's probably just the wrapping. Let's see if uh, what happens when we try and open this. What is in here? Okay, interesting. It looks like we have a dried strawberry. So kind of nervous, <laughs> but I do like strawberries. Let's see what it is. What the? This has the consistency of like a chocolate. How do they do that? Wow, that is delicious. It's like a white chocolate, a strawberry mix, like strawberries and cream. Mmm, whoa. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I was expecting like some kind of chewy strawberry because you know, we've all had dried mangoes, like they're chewy. There's the, another pack of the mochis, excited for that. Let's open some more packs. Gotta get the second out of there, and I gotta give so many of these to Amy. Oh, I don't know what one to try next. I wish we were live right now, so then you could all tell me what to try, <laughs> because uh, that'd be a lot more fun. But, Glaceon VMAX, two hits in a row, let's go. Putting the VMAXs in a sleeve as well, because why not? I think they're beautiful, and I would love to get every single a uh, bigger EV card in a slab of some sort someday, whenever they open back up. Hey, we got the full art version of this. Focus. But uh, yeah, hopefully we have a few more hits in this box because we pulled that full art pretty early. I'm just hoping that this is a good box because like I said, this is our fourth EV Heroes box that we've opened here on the channel and we have not had the best of luck, guys. We've I mean, every single box, you're guaranteed a secret rare. So you can't complain, um, but if you're to get a good box, like a really good box, then you get the second secret rare, which is usually like a, a rainbow or a gold. Uh, but in this case, we are wanting the alt art. Umbreons, evolutions. why did I say Umbreons? <laughs> I do want Umbreon, that's probably the alternate art that I want the most, either the VMAX or the normal V. Oh man, just such cool cards. I did just send in the Espeon VMAX alternate art card to PSA, so I'm hoping that grades well. Speaking of Espeon, there it is right there. I still need you. This is our first time pulling, oops, <laughs> this uh, Espeon card. So that is going in my little Evolutions binder. Very happy about that. And let's see what we're trying. I love chips. So we're gonna open up this bigger bag right here and see what is inside. Uh, I'm assuming they're chips because they are hard. Arr! This bag's giving me some difficulties here. Mmm. Smells salty like a chip. So here we go. Let's let's take out a few. They are small. Look at that. It looks like a looks like a fry. Honestly, like little little fries. You can hear the crunch, right? Wow. Those are delicious. There's like that hint of salt or whatever they season these things with, and then it just tastes like cherry or whatever thing that is. That is so weird. 
Japan does it so well. They mix the flavors like crazy and it just works, guys. Seriously, that is delicious. All right, next up, next up. I think we have a few more packs left on this right side. Probably got the bigger hit, oops, of the box, of the side at least. Focus, there we go. But um, yeah, other than that, other than this sponsor, we have um, Evolving Skies coming just around the corner. I have not heard from any of my friends or anything about pre-orders or anything, so I'm kind of nervous <laughs> because it is a set that I really want a lot of. Like, a lot, a lot. So many cool cards, so many sweet alternate arts, and uh, it's, it's gonna be a massive set. So I'm, I'm excited to see what we can do with it, but we won't, Umbreon, yes, love my boy Umbreon. Very nice hit. Um, we won't be able to do anything if we get no Evolving Skies. But uh, guys, another thing, you have to let me know if you um, join Boksu. Because I would love <laughs> to hear what you guys think about all these treats. And seriously, I need to get on the plan um, because I want to see what other themes they got and just taste everything. I love Japanese treats so much. I think they are the best ones. So, oh. <laughs> Another Sylveon, guys. I have gotten four Sylveons now, which is good. Sylveon's probably one of the better VMAXs to get. But I believe, I, I think we've gotten all the VMAXs by now, right? They have the, well, not the alt arts. We have the Umbreon, we got the Sylveon, Glaceon, and uh, Leafeon. I don't think there's a VMAX of the normal ones in this set. Normal meaning the, the Kanto starter ones. Kanto, I cannot talk, Kanto ones. I think that just means it's time for a snack. Um, let's see, what caught my attention this cookie caught my attention yes it did i assume that's like chocolate mixed in the middle there very nice we're about to try it because i love cookies here we go oh yes right there here we go gotta smell it first oh i already i'm, I'm gonna like it oh it's so soft mm. now that was the most japanese thing that I've tasted yet. Just tastes like Japan. Mmm! <laughs> and I love how soft it is. I have no idea what's in the middle. But I need to save the rest for my wife. Or else she might get mad because that one's delish. Oh man, guys. I, oh, this one's scaring me a little. That one is freaking me out. But we might need to try it. Like I said, we're getting risky here with the Omash Nation. <laughs> But yeah, you guys have to let me know what you guys think uh, when you subscribe to the box because Vaporeon, very nice, getting all the normal V-pulls here. Uh, I'd love to hear what you th your thoughts are on the Japanese side of the world. Uh, obviously there are like Asian marketplaces around uh, where I live. My mom frequents them all the time. <laughs> but um, there aren't that many like Japanese snacks. There's a lot more Chinese and Korean stuff. And so anytime I can get anything Japanese, I'm all over it because I think they're just delicious. They're just fun to eat. They're super good. And what's so good about Japanese treats is they don't overdo it. Like you don't feel sick after eating a ton of Japanese treats. Eldegoss, which is pretty cool. Um, and I keep opening way too many packs compared to the treats we are eating. So let's see. After this one, we will try another one. And hey, Sylveon, very nice. This is a Sylveon box. We're gonna save this one for last. I wanna try this chocolate, uh, I assume that's chocolate, cake thing because I love Japanese bakeries. Um, I think everything they make is so good. The best donuts I've ever had were in Japan. Mr. Donut to be exact. All right, here we go. I need to wash my hands after this one. Oh, it's just so soft. Here we go, let's. Very interesting. It's like a chocolate green tea cake. I can taste the green tea quite a bit, but then you get that subtle like tiny chocolate chip. Mmm, that's delicious. 
So good. <laughs> this is like the most, most fun opening I've ever done because of all this food I get to eat. <laughs> so once again, thank you Boksu for the amazing treats. I am in love with your product and I know everyone else will be as well as we need to throw some stuff away. Try and get a few more hits. Not sure if it's gonna happen though. I mean, there's a hit, but I'm talking alt art. Maybe we just hit a little bad luck spree because it shouldn't be this hard opening four boxes and not getting a single alternate art card. I saw plenty of friends getting them on like every single box they opened. <laughs> so we probably just pulled the short straw, but you know what? It's okay because we got a nice boxu box to lighten us up and fill our stomachs with some goodies. Guys, if you love, <laughs> if you have liked this content, please let me know in the comments um, because I would like to maybe try and do some more stuff like this. Boxu, if you're listening, uh, which I hope you are, this is last pack, guys. Last pack magic. Let's see if we can end it. Um, I would love to get some more boxes from you, so maybe we can work and do something out there. Come on, I see something sparkly. It's probably just a hollow, and of course it's Grim Snarl. But guys, to end this video, we have to... <laughs> I'm nervous. I have no idea what this is, but that's an adorable uh, little bear. Oh boy. We're gonna try it. I wish there was time to try everything on camera with you guys, but I think you guys got the gist of what is going on here. This is a very, just hard, solid thing. Mmm. Definitely the strangest one we've eaten today. But a lot of these flavors that are going on in my mouth right now, I've definitely eaten a lot of. And I know my mom would love this. <laughs> But guys, that was so awesome. Thank you, Boksu, once again. My favorite thing that we tried today so far has got to be those little mochi things. I just love mochi, anything mochi, and that was delicious. So thank you so much, guys. Remember to use my code. Everything is in the description below, but it is also right here, OMASH20, to get 20% off your first Boksu box. Such a killer deal, because I know you're gonna love every single thing here. It literally just took put me on a plane, took me over to Japan, and let me live a little Japanese culture for a few minutes, and it was awesome. Thank you so much, Boksu. I would love to do something like this again. Omash Nation, you're all awesome. Thanks for all the love and support. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to check out Boksu, and I hope you have the best rest of the day, and I will catch you next time.